I wish everybody could be here in the stadium right now. Watch the flags flow up the stadium walls, the big go Cougs, the big Y, the big Cougar head. You can tell the fans are ready. Man, you just don't know what you're a part of until you raise a family, make a living. What an amazing moment for these guys. And then, Greg, how about this? Bringing a route all the way across the middle of the field and letting him hit that slant. He finds the soft area in the zone set by Southern Utah, and Slovis finds the soft set in the zone as well and delivers it perfectly to Isaac Rex that just finds that nice gap in coverage. You just say, let's take all the mystery out of it. Let's put this pressure on the quarterback and let's take their options away. LJ Martin is doing things outside of just taking advantage of the blocking scheme. He's stopping and pausing and making a safety think. Or he's running through an arm tackle. Harrison Taggart fights through the three-man backfield protection, gets his hand up, and he's able to stick his hand on it. What a great block by Harrison Taggart. And this is going to be an e as easy a touchdown as BYU's going to find. you got blowing coverage with Keanu Hill coming right across the baseline, wide open. That's a pitch and catch. Get a guard that gets on the outside, but Isaac Rex is able to pick up a safety on the back end of this and really push him downfield to give Lasseter the opportunity to skate down that sideline for that touchdown. Lasseter did some really nice things on the back end of that to be an individual, but that took an Isaac Rex block to make something like that happen. BYU's defense is really squared up. They've got really responsibility-oriented, and I don't think Southern Utah is going to be able to match them square up. They're going to have to get a little squirrely. I told you I keep my own stats, and every time I see a bat at ball, I give a sack to that defender. So Jackson Craven, that's a sack. I don't care who you are, how you look at it, that's a sack in my opinion. And a really nice pass. Beautiful ball. Beautiful ball, right speed and tempo on it. It's almost like a car was speeding right past him, and he just snuck the hands out and grabbed a 100-mile-per-hour car. I love that. It is such a beautiful thing watching a receiver or a tight end just snatch it out of the air. And as that's being snapped, Deion Smith is just passing by the quarterback, and he just nonchalantly hands it to Deion in full speed around that edge. I love that play design. It's so hard to defend. You really have to have a good outside presence. And they beat Southern Utah to the corner. Marcus McKenzie has become your special team superhero. He is your X-Man. He is Batman. He is Superman. He is everything that you need in special teams. That wind is kicking up, but it's not stiff enough to blow out the fires on those fire knife throws. Throwing those knives up in the air with wind blowing like that or, that are lit on fire? You guys are crazy, man. You know what I loved about that touchdown? I love quarterbacks that keep their eyes down the field. He had a wide open view. He could have ran that easily for 10 yards, but keeps his eye down the field, finds his receiver late, and throws for the touchdown.